bien, bien, bien. Ale Nelson, Ale Nelson. Venga, que ha acabado, eh. Que ha acabado y es todo bajada, eh. Ale, bien, 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 bien. Venga, mucho, mucho. Ale, venga, hasta arriba, eh. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Qué bien, qué bien, qué bien, qué bien, qué bien. Ale Nelson, Ale Nelson. Well, first of all, I have to say that until now, I've always had good luck when running races in Switzerland. Things always turn out successfully here. As a matter of fact, I've won two editions of the Tour de Suisse and was three times third at the Tour de Romandie. So the results here are always positive. Of course, this race is to some extent a preparation for the Tour de France as well. This year will be my first as a team leader, which is a big challenge and responsibility for me. I want to achieve as much as I can for the Lompre Merida team. The team is giving me every kind of support I need, and I'm very grateful for that. The riders in the team are top level, and I know I can rely on them, which makes me very confident. Y tengo una gran equipo y sé que puedo contar con el equipo y eso es lo que me deja más, más tranquilo. I'm Jürgen Falke, Director of Products at Merida, and we are one day ahead of the start of Tour de Suisse. And for this event, we prepared a brand new bike for our world champion at Lampre Merida, Rui Costa. The name of the product is Reacto Com, and the KOM is a synonym for King of Mountain. It was our ambition to realize a bike which is, despite its aerodynamic quality, are close to the UCI weight limit of 6.8 kilograms. The regular team bikes are around 7.3 kilograms. That means half a kilo is missing to the UCI limit. And it was our aim to provide a bike to Rio Costa, which is as light as possible by keeping all the original benefits. Starting with the frame, we uh, use different carbon fiber layups, different types of fibers, and uh, we were not able to save huge amounts in one step. It's a kind of collecting piece by piece, but uh, due to different coating of the frame, we arrive at a saving of about 70 grams, 30 grams at the fork. We have a one piece aerodynamic seat post, different to the two piece standard one. At the headset, we are using special bearings with aluminum cups. A saving of 15 grams might not sound really spectacular, but 15 grams here, uh, 70 grams at the frame, 50 grams at the post, 30 grams at the fork. And uh, all the minor improvements at components finally offer a summary of uh, about half a kilogram. And at the end, we came uh, exactly to the 6.8 kilograms, which is allowed by the UCI for pro road bikes. This new bike will help Rui Costa to keep the aerodynamic benefit of the reactor and uh, climb as well as efficient as possible in the steep and high mountains of Switzerland during the next week and the coming Tour de France.
Well, normally, like all of us, we travel quite a lot all over the year. I enjoy traveling to the races, that's normal. Apart from that, I don't spend my free time traveling around. Back at home, I prefer to spend time with my family and my girlfriend. In fact, the only time I travel is when there are races. As for the rest, well, I prefer to stay at home and relax. No, well, what I have noticed since I won the World Championship is that there are more shows of affection from people. People demonstrate much more affection towards me and there are more that support me. Everywhere I meet more people that support me and I'm very grateful for all that backing. On the other hand, I have less time now and have to be more organized in every respect, both in terms of training and recovery, as well as with regard to the social networks, to spend a little time with the people that support me. Well, I used to listen to every kind of music, a little of everything. There's not really a style I like most. Usually some international music, bits of Portuguese songs, you know, bits of everything, like Chris Brown, Rihanna, then Portuguese artists, just a little bit of everything. Before a race, I usually warm up for an hour and a half in order to get to the start in the best possible condition.
After winning the 2012 and 2013 Tour de Suisse edition, Rui has to start in the yellow jersey and with the number one. Well, the planning usually goes on behalf of the sports director that's in charge at each race and who lines out and presents the program. Normally, it's Machine who's responsible for the paperwork. Afterwards, we have breakfast at a time that depends on the kind of competition, race or time trial. On time trial days, we have breakfast usually three and a half hours before because a time trial is much more violent and explosive in terms of effort and you need to have assimilated the meal completely. What follows is always the transfer to the race. See, well, I don't have really many rituals. As a matter of fact, I usually do the sign of the cross because I'm Christian and I feel good with it. At each start or whenever I take the bicycle, I cross myself. That's my ritual, really.
decir que, que estoy muy contento con, con Merida porque realmente... Well, I can only say I'm very pleased with Merida. Since the beginning of the season, well, since October last year, as a matter of fact, they're doing a really great job, and I'm very happy for all that support and commitment that they show towards me. I think they're contributing in a very positive and important manner to my career and my motivation. In fact, the new bicycle I had the chance to try recently at the Race Classic the other day shows their commitment and how important their job is for me. I'm very grateful to Merida, and if truth be said, it's the best bicycle I've ever ridden to this day. It's a very beautiful bicycle. I like it very much. It's very light, very rigid and very, very fast. I am very happy and I'm looking forward to achieving great things with Merida. Stage 2 is done, but there are still seven stages to go. One week later, Rui wins Stage 9 and the overall ranking of the Tour de Suisse for the third time.